And welcome back to Ozarks Live. Michelle, alongside her daughters with PKD Venue Cafe and Catering, join me now. Good to see you ladies again. How are you? Very good. Very good. Thank you for coming back. Super excited to have you. Super excited for what you brought. But we'll get to that in a second. Remind people a little bit about your business and how it works. Okay. So we are a cafe. We're open Tuesday through Saturday, 7 a.m. to 2 o'clock in the afternoon. We have a drive through We're just a cafe. Good food. Specialized in our breakfast burritos. Yes. And then we are a catering company. And we're also an event venue. So we have our event venue space with rooms. And now we just opened a commercial commentary rental kitchen as well so, so it's safe to say that you keep yourself busy yes <laughs> yes huh girls we're always busy they're like yeah. yes mom yes yeah. <laughs> all the time um so if someone was interested in renting out one of your spaces how would they go about doing that uh just give us a call and my manager um or my son juan will get a hold just he'll give you the tour and just get it booked. It's a really easy process. Okay, very cool. Mm -hmm. Now, um, the main reason you're here today is you kind of have a special initiative running specifically for the holiday season right now that I just think is really important, especially for the community, especially this time of year. Tell me what's going on. Okay, so my daughter was strolling on Facebook and just on social media and somebody had posted in Republic where they were like holiday meals. They were pre-purchased holiday meals for people that might be hungry mm -hmm. and couldn't afford a meal. And so, she, my girls right away, well, let's do this. And so I said, okay, let's go. So immediately that next Tuesday, she got online, she did it, she put it on there, took pictures. I said, well, as, as we'll just go ahead and pay for the first 10 meals. Yeah. We just, she put them up on the wall and then she posted it on Facebook and it just went crazy. So we have people, a few people that's come in and utilize the meals. We've had other business give us gift cards to their restaurants mm -hmm. to put on the wall. Uh, we had the Republic Police Department come and buy meals today for individuals, and it's really just been a great thing. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I mean, the power of social media and partnerships just goes such a long way. True. Why is this specific, like, cause, I guess, so important to you? Well, I grew up um, hungry. Mm -hmm. I mean, we didn't have much, and I grew up on the streets and in and out of different foster homes, and so I know what it's like to be hungry and mm -hmm. to live out of a food pantry. That was my life growing up. Mm -hmm. um, you know, my daughters and I, you know, we, we know what it's like. Our family, we've been through times where jobs have been lost and we've struggled. Sure. And like they, we've said, just because you have a nice vehicle or you look presentable, that just doesn't mean, you know, you don't deserve a blessing. Absolutely. And so, yeah, absolutely. That's really, really important. All right. So walk me through some of these things that you brought in today because it all looks delicious. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. So right here, we've got our breakfast burritos, mm -hmm. and this is our chorizo and our grandpa burrito, which is sausage. Okay. And we sell, and we will roll up to five to 100 to 1,000 of these before we ever open some days. Oh my gosh. And we sell them in catering in the mass amounts, mm -hmm. and then people just always are calling and texting to order them, so they're very, very popular. We have a couple different meats you can get. Mm -hmm. And then these right here are our cinnamon rolls, and they're one of our only pastries that we do. And we have sold, I don't even know how I was gonna look before I got here today. <laughs> Too many. Yeah, because right now we have our BOGO cinnamon roll, and mm -hmm. it's just today and tomorrow. So those go pretty crazy. Yeah, and the thing is, I wanna point this out. You were telling me in the break that these are kind of a special order you brought me in, because today's been a crazy day. Tell me yes. why. So we have sold out of our cinnamon rolls today seven times, mm -hmm. and we're only open from seven to two. We sold out seven times. Yeah. And so we were making, pre-making batches fresh for in the morning, mm. and my had one of my line cooks say, let's make a batch and bring with us. Mm -hmm. And so we pulled from that just to bring here today. Yeah, tell me a little bit about like how you've come up with your menu, kind of what I guess you choose to to serve people? So in all honesty, um, again, I am a self-taught chef. Mm -hmm. So my, like I grew up cooking out of a food pantry. Mm -hmm. You just put stuff in the pan and you cook it. You just and see what works. Exactly. So I sold probably 45 of these refugio burritos before I ever even tasted it myself. Oh my gosh. I just cook it and then my struggle is nailing down the recipes, and my girls are always cooking with me. And <laughs> They're both smiling. We're just uh -huh. like dumping stuff, <laughs> and like, Ma, write it down. So Jalen here, she's run the line and the, uh, cooked when she was 11, uh, completely by herself before oh my gosh. Rush. So yeah, it's definitely the whole family in there, and. And our employees are pretty amazing. Yeah, so. it's a family effort. And the thing that I love about this too is I can just tell this is a labor of love for you, which mm -hmm. goes such a long way. Mm -hmm. Michelle, if people want more information, want to keep up with everything you and your business are doing, how can they do that? Just Google us, go on Facebook. When you message us on Facebook, you message me directly. Okay. So, yeah. 
so that you're the person that they'll reach. That's yes, great. Yes, it is. Ladies, thank you for being here. Thank you for what you're doing for the community. People go out, get someone else a meal this holiday season, and thanks for being here. We appreciate it. Thanks, Blake. All right, well, coming up, more from Tease Redneck Steakhouse. Stay with us.